in the second half of 2022, the reports about a drama titled The Price of Confession garnered a lot of attention. The reason why this particular drama got so much media coverage was due to its incredible lineup of actors who were supposed to take the lead roles and who started to tease the audience with what was to come. In the reports, it was revealed that Han Sohi would be taking on the main role of an anti-social student who is very mysterious and people around her fear her. The character fits Sohi's nature perfectly and everybody agreed that she was a great casting choice. On the other hand, the critically acclaimed actress Song Hye Kyo was meant to take on the role of an art teacher who wants nothing but a normal, happy life, but instead she gets entangled in a crime. Now, imagine having these two amazing actresses star in a drama side by side. The reason why everyone was so hyped up about this is that Hye Kyo had an incredible success with The Glory, so you can see why people were thirsty to see more of her great acting. But what really made people go crazy was the fact that the two characters were supposed to be in a sort of love relationship. According to the initial reports, the characters wouldn't be dating, but there would be strong feelings of affection between them, borderline romantic. News like this made many international fans put the drama on their watch list as it's not every day that we get to see women have feelings for one another in K-dramas. As the casting was announced, with it also the director was revealed and people were even happier. The director was supposed to be Lee Ung Bak, who is famous for many popular dramas such as Mr. Sunshine and Sweet Home. He was working on The Price of Confession for a long time, and it was listed as a mystery thriller. Since both Song Hye Kyo and Han Sohi were praised repeatedly for their amazing acting in thriller dramas, it was no surprise that viewers were over the moon with the news. But things seemed to have been too perfect, and it was only a matter of time when something would go wrong. As soon as the news got out, people started to stalk the Instagram accounts of both actresses. The thing is, they both began to interact with each other online, commenting on each other's posts and flirtatiously responding to one another. This was perceived as the beginning of the fan service in preparation for the release of The Price of Confession. Since the drama was supposed to have some girl love aspects, viewers were truly going wild for their interactions. Han Sohi first posted a photo with Hye Kyo on her Instagram with the caption, The Price of Confession, which only solidified the rumors of the two starring together and working on the drama. Then when Hikio posted a photo from the glory, so he flirtatiously commented, mine now, referring to their characters who were having feelings for one another. It already looked like the two had great chemistry together and enjoyed each other's company. Song Hikio was still at her peak thanks to the success of the glory and she had been receiving praise left and right. On the other hand, so he was one of the most well-known Netflix actresses and she had a huge international following thanks to her unique looks and vibe, but things turned sour pretty quick and fans got extremely disappointed. A few months went by and in January 2023, it was revealed that Lee Ung Bak decided to drop the project and leave the production. Then in May 2023, the media outlets started to report one by one that Song Hye Kyo and Han So Hee decided to quit filming the drama as well. At that point, the rumors started to run wild. It's not uncommon for dramas to go through cast changes in the pre-production stage as many actors often need to unexpectedly change their schedules. But with The Price of Confession, the reason seems to be different. The first sign that pointed to there being trouble was when the reports rolled in. Everything that was being said sounded fishy and lacked any sort of proper argument for them to not continue with the drama. To the fans, it seemed crazy that a drama with such a star-studded cast and with already so much hype would just get canceled because of minor problems. What's more, the reports were purposefully vague and when the journalists reached out to Ye Kyo's and So He's agencies, the response they got was strange to say the least. For example, according to the article on Sumpi, Ye Kyo's agency responded with a super short statement that said, we are in the process of checking. It is difficult to answer precisely at this moment. But even more shocking was the statement of So He's agency because from that one, the public found out that not even the agency knew about the drama falling through until the reports rolled in. Her agency specifically said, we also learned about the news that actress Han So Hee's appearance in The Price of Confession got canceled from the reports. We are currently checking the related information. But the whole thing got even stranger when the reporters started to dig in and approach the production company to get their statement. Studio Dragon was the company responsible for producing The Price of Confession. And when asked about the two actors, 
actresses leaving the drama, they responded with, Casting related matters are handled exclusively by our co-producing company, Production H. We do not know anything in this regard. And so the reporters approached Production H, but they got a similar response from them as well. The person from Production H answered that they have no specific person in charge, which is strange to begin with, and they ended their statement by saying, We are currently trying to figure out what happened. So to sum it up, no company and not a single soul involved in the production of the drama seemed to have any knowledge about there being a casting issue. But there was a reason behind it after all. As we mentioned, the director Lee Ung Bok left the project first. In January 2023, he claimed that due to scheduling conflicts, he would no longer be able to work on the drama and therefore he would allow the production company to hire a new director to finish it. This was pretty understandable because Ung Bok was busy finishing filming Sweet Home Season 2 and 3. But as it turns out at the time, the production company was having a difficult time finding a new director to take over. They approached Shim Nayeon, who directed The Good Bad Mother and Beyond Evil, but she rejected the offer too. At this point, it looked like the drama was cursed and everyone wanted to stay away from it. But keep in mind that when the director left, both Sohee and Hyekyo were reported to be still holding on to their roles in the drama. The reports changed though when finally a new director accepted the offer. Lee Jong Yo, who had previously directed Crash Landing on You and Duna, decided to take on the price of confession. But with that came big changes and it was announced that both Han So Hee and Song Hye Kyo chose to ultimately reject the offer and decided to not star in the drama. The rumors were running wild as many people believed that the actresses had an issue with the new production team and the director. Media outlets cited irreconcilable differences as the cause for the change of hearts and it left fans in shock. What was even more shocking was that apparently the actresses turned down the offer way before it was revealed as they were extremely dissatisfied with the lack of communication between them and the production company. What was allegedly also an issue is that they had different opinions on how the relationship between them should be portrayed and the production company didn't want to accept it. What's more, the original director Lee Ung Bok was actually the one who cast Song Hye Kyo and Han So Hee and it's alleged that the three of them agreed to reject the drama together due to the bad communication with Studio Dragon and Production H. According to an article from Sports Donga, the production company refused to schedule a meeting with the whole team during which they could discuss how to proceed with the drama, and they also refused to hear out the cast's and director's opinions. When this came out, it was widely believed that the price of confession would get completely canceled. As the main stars bid farewell to the drama, Han So Hee wanted to disperse any speculation about them feuding and even commented on Hye Kyo's post writing, still mine, once again referencing their character's relationship. But to everyone's surprise, the production of the drama decided to continue, and the new director, Lee Jong Hyo, started to search for a new cast. John Do Yeon received the offer for the role of the art teacher in December, and her agency confirmed that she was considering accepting it. The trouble was with casting the role of the anti social student. As it was revealed in the latest reports, Kim Ji Wan had received the offer but rejected it immediately, and the production company handed it to another actress, this time Kim Go Eun. At first, she took her time considering it but ended up accepting the offer alongside John Do Yeon. The representative agencies of the two actresses are currently working out the scheduling with the production company of The Price of Confession. And it's rumored that the drama should come out either at the end of 2024 or at the beginning of 2025. And although the drama is being produced and has a new cast, fans still cannot believe that we've been robbed of the amazing song Hye Kyo and Han So Hee starring together in a mystery thriller with a girl love storyline.